Hi and welcome to another video. So I have this cassette which doesn't spin only in one way. See sometimes it spins in the other way too. So I will try to fix it. So this is the first time I'm I'm opening one and I don't know if I can fix it but at least I have a look inside and see what causes this problem so to open it I will use this tool to remove the locking nut mine is already loose So now the cogs will, will come off. If you never opened one, you have inside these um, small notches and you have one even smaller. So it can only go one way. This is called free hub but this one is way too free because it spins in both ways okay it has something that's screwed here so we need to remove that first mine is already loose Sometimes it works, see, but just sometimes don't. I made this tool. Don't worry about this thing inside, it's just a anti-theft socket. I will use this adjustable spanner. So because this one is threaded the other way, is threaded in the way that cassette spins free I need to put it on the hub as well So it has some, not sure if you can see, it has some bearing balls here. And some, some other ones here. So this is the inside, it has some ratchet teeth inside. I'll just clean it a bit so you can see better. I don't know if 
you can see here but they are kind of worn this is the free hub body which has two poles and the snap ring keeping the poles in place so I will remove everything give it a good clean then put them back together and see if it works okay so now that I've cleaned everything I will put them back together so when it spins like this it should spin uh, the entire body like this And when it spins this way, it should spin freely because the poles will be closed. Okay, now I will I will grease the poles in the hinge area. The other one too. and I will put the spring I think I put too much grease on this one and if you put too much grease if you put on this end as well it will it won't allow him it won't allow it to go back to spring back like this because the grease will, will keep it there so I'll try to clean it See, this one doesn't have that much grease in there. So this is the way it works. Okay, so the spring was kind of loose and I tighten it a little. So now it works as it should. Now I'll put grease here because the I have to put the bearing balls as well. There are 25 on on each end. 
of the free hub. Okay, now I need to put this washer back here. 